And drivers expecting to travel on the roads within the next few hours should make sure to plan ahead and check the road conditions. KTSM 9 News reporter Tatiana Favela is live in West El Paso. She continues our Weather Authority alert coverage. Texas El Paso says it's ahead of the game when treating the roads against winter weather conditions, making sure that drivers' commutes are as safe as possible if they must be out on the roads. First and foremost, don't be out um, if you don't need to be out driving in inclement weather. As El Paso prepares to enter freezing temperatures in the coming days, Texas El Paso is reminding drivers to avoid driving on the roads under freezing conditions unless it's absolutely necessary. If you do need to get somewhere, uh, please check your conditions before you leave. Uh, check those conditions on the roadways. You can do that through drivetexas.org. That's an online um, website that we have that will show you the roadways across Texas and will show you any closures due to weather, construction, or crashes. Here you can see some tanks that are filled with brine, a salt water mixture that pre-treats roads against weather conditions like snow or black ice. Texas El Paso says crews continue treating the roads early Monday morning on I-10 from Anthony to Sierra Blanca, Loop 375, and US 62180. If you see our crews out there, please provide them the space that they need to do the work that they need to help keep you safe. Don't get in between our convoys. Um, stay away from the vehicles as they're treating the roadways. If you see snow plows or any other equipment out there, um, please uh, keep your distance and drive safely. If you are driving under these conditions, make sure to drive slowly, don't follow closely to other vehicles, and be especially careful over bridges, ramps, and overpasses. Those are the first to freeze. Stock crews will also be on standby outside of El Paso if additional support is needed. Live in West El Paso, Tatiana Favela, KTSM 9 News.